And developing now, a rally is planned outside the Gwinnett County Board of Education in support of an alleged sexual assault victim. An attorney for a former Peachtree Ridge High School student says she was sexually assaulted by another student inside the school last year. On Fox Eyes, Marissa Mitchell, live in Gwinnett County tonight. Marissa, what have you learned? Well, there's a small group gathered out here now, but the attorney tells me that supporters of that former student will gather here tonight. They all argue that the school system should have done more. Sexual assault victims should be supported and not blamed. And when schools like Peachtree Ridge punish students who report sexual assault, they further traumatize them. That should never happen. And was suspended shortly after she reported her sexual assault before there was any hearing. Now, Gwinnett County Public Schools says it conducted a thorough and prompt investigation and interviewed all parties. The system sent Fox 5 a statement that reads, in part, after several days of investigation, the local school made a decision based on a preponderance of evidence that the accused and the accuser both violated school rules and that the accuser had not been a victim of sexual assault. Now, the attorney out here says that the victim and her family have filed a federal complaint against the school system and are pursuing charges as well criminally. Now we will continue to monitor what happens outside here as well as what may happen inside of that school board meeting plan tonight. That's the latest here in Gwinnett County. Marissa Mitchell, Fox 5 News. Thank you, Marissa. Also developing tonight,